me get a picture of you in front of the dam. Brown. The mystery novelist. She has three bestsellers to my six. Well, did you ever say anything about her stuff? Uh, based on her last book, I describe it as a collection of simple declarative sentences, devoid of style, actually, and interest. He decided to go into business for himself. What, like a roadside sperm stand? Almost. The victim was selling his sperm online? Yep. You've been letting a fly grow in your neck for the last month? Yeah. <laughs> You're insane. You want me to be your midwife? I was thinking more like birthing partner. I'm reminded of a quote by Ray Bradbury who said, I don't need an alarm clock. My ideas wake me. I assume you're a sound sleeper, Dr. Brennan. Now I believe you owe me an apology, Ms. Brown. Oh, God. I really wish I could just hang out in the waiting room smoking cigars with the other dad. <laughs> Here it comes! There's gotta be something in the rule book about playing host to an insect. Maybe Sweets really doesn't want to work at the FBI anymore. I got a dead Estrella Locos on my head. Del Campo's street name was El Carnicero. The Butcher. That thing looks pretty sharp. Dr. Sweets, it is good to see you back. I'm not actually back yet. I'm just here to help Booth out with the case. Then I didn't mean what I said. I figured. Dr. Hodgins! Oh. Hey, can everyone just relax, okay? Calm down. You're gonna shoot a little boy now? No, 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 it's okay. Is that how you keep us safe? You see what he did? <laughs>